the fourth chakra. Today we work with our fourth chakra, the heart chakra. Our hands and our arms are an extension of our heart. So we'll work with our hands and arms a lot today. Our heart is the essence of our life. And when we have an active, balanced heart chakra, we feel that interconnectedness with everything surrounding us and within ourselves. We feel happier, more in gratitude, and more in that state of happiness, joy, and willingness to listen and to put ourselves in the shoes of someone and be more compassionate. So let's start. Wrap the palms briskly, palms together to the chest, inhale, and exhale. We're gonna sing yam three times, Y-A-M. Yum. Inhale. Yum. Yum. Inhale. Hold your breath. Exhale. Inhale and bring your arms up, like making a V and bring them forward a little bit. Keep your arms straight, your fingers all pointing up and together. And we're going to make circular movements with the arms backwards. Close your eyes and we can either do long deep breaths or a trip, or breath of five. Inhale, hold the posture, hold the breath. Close Mula Banda, hold the pelvic area, sphincter muscles. Exhale. Inhale again. Hold, bring the tip of the tongue to the roof of the mouth. Exhale. One more time, inhale. Hold. and exhale and gently bring your hands down to your knees take a moment here to feel your body after this breathing exercise activating our heart chakra open your eyes and now we're gonna lie down on the floor put our belly down and we're gonna do the bow pose so bend your knees. If you can grab your feet or your ankles, grab them. If not, you can keep your knees bent and your arms back to the sides. And from here, we're gonna roll up and down. So it can be here or here. Breathing If rocking gets uncomfortable, you can hold the posture and continue focusing on the breathing. Inhale and exhale and release. Bring the feet down, place one cheek on the mat and breathe here. Yes. 
Now gently open your eyes, bring your hands under the shoulders, inhaling, come up and go to child's pose and rest in child's pose for a moment. You can bring the palms together, thumbs pointing up like antennas, and take this moment to connect with your attitude of gratitude. You think of something you're grateful for, either because you have it or because you want to develop that virtue in yourself, and think about it as if it is already yours. Now, inhaling, come up. Take your feet to one side and lie down on the mat with your back on the floor. Inhaling, bend the knees to the chest, hug the knees, and we're going to rock and roll up and down, trying to roll through the whole spine. Gently inhaling, come back, hug the knees towards your chest, and exhale. Now we're going to come up. You can either roll over to one side using your hands, come up to stand in posture, or you can roll, use the momentum to stand up, or to sit and to stand. And from here, separate your feet about hip distance your heels about hip distance apart and your toes pointing up. We're gonna do squats. It can be standing squats or it can be all the way down to the crow squats, your choice. Interlace your fingers in Venus lock. So you interlace the fingers and you lift the right thumb on the flesh of the left, the right thumb on the flesh of the left side or the left thumb on the flesh of the other side, whatever feels comfortable for you and place your hands above your head. And here, inhale and exhale, squat. As I said, it can be standing squat or it can be going all the way down. Inhale up, exhale up. Breathing as you move, connecting the movement with the breath. Make sure the knees are in line with the toes, especially knee with the second toe. One more time, inhaling, come up, keep your eyes closed. Exhaling, release the arms and bring the arms down to the sides of the body. Take a few breaths here, palms facing forward. Now open your eyes and come to sitting on the floor. And now sitting on the floor, find a comfortable position with your back straight and bring your hands over your chest. Left hand first, then the right one. Close your eyes and focus on your breath. Inhaling through the nose and exhaling through the nose. Feel your heart beat. Feel that strength within you that goes beyond your muscles. Try to focus on your breath. When you realize that your mind went away, 
Just bring it back to your breath without judging. Exhaling gently, bring your hands down and keep your eyes closed and lie down on the mat for a final relaxation. We start bringing consciousness back to the body. We hold your hands, toes, fingers. Make circular movements with your arms and ankles. Inhale and stretch your arms above your head. Give a good stretch to the left side and to the right side. Wrap the palms briskly, the soles of the feet briskly. Stimulating the 72,000 nerve endings in the body. And bring your hands to your knees. We are going to sit up. You can either roll up or roll over to one side and come to a seated position. And from here, keep your eyes closed, your shoulders relaxed. And take this moment to feel grateful for all the blessings in your life. Take this moment to account those people, those circumstances that you are grateful for. And bless them, and bless your path, and bless your life. Because every relationship, every circumstance is an opportunity for us to grow, to help, to be the light to someone else to receive the light from someone else or to connect with the light within us. Inhaling, bring both arms up, palms together. Exhaling, palms together to the chest. Inhale. May the long term sun shine upon you, all love surround you, and the pure light within you guide your way on. Satnam.